everybody and welcome back to the Chris Ford show man I'm in a good mood but I'm finna give y'all a, a real sad tale man over the uh over the weekend seven thousand pounds of marijuana were found floating in the fucking water off, off the coast of this beach. 7,000 pounds of marijuana. I gotta tell you, man, it's, it's sad, man. It's real sad, man. 160 bales of good, probably some Afghan hybrid sour diesel sativa blend strand of good cushy weed left out there in the water man estimated street value three million dollars Here at the Chris Ford Show, we believe in legalization of pot. We believe that it will make our country better. The jobs it will create. But one thing we don't go for here is neglect. 160 bales of marijuana should be treated with the care of a child. Why, you ask? Because if you transporting 160 bales of marijuana, 7,000 pounds a pot, worth $3 million, and you let something happen to that baby, you ain't finna see your family no more. Somebody gonna kill you over some money like that, man. Real talk. Now, me personally, man, <clears throat> it's a travesty, man, that that this pot didn't get to its destination because it it would have. It would have got out there in no time. And and I, I'd be on the look for, you know, a little, a little something better than, than what I blaze now. But mm, when I found this out, man, I, I was I was hurt, like, instantly. Like, damn. Every time I hear about an enormous amount of weed or... Something that has the potential of just being that ultimate relaxer. Something like this happened, man. Why is that, man? Hmm. Why is that when when it's supposed to be some new reefer coming around, some good shit come around, whoever transporting it always fuck up. Always. Another story, man. This dude, um... This dude in, in Florida. He um he was uh getting his little getting his little re up together, man. He was he was on the way back to his little his little spot, man, his little trap with his weed. Bro man get pulled over. He can't understand why he get pulled over, man. He done left the spot, went and got the package. Somewhere in between from getting that package and getting back to the spot, he got pulled over. He thinking, damn, what the fuck did I do? I ain't speeding. My music ain't playing too loud. I got my seatbelt on. What the fuck, man? Officer walks up to the car and says, sir, you committed a rolling stop back there. I'm going to need to see your driver's license and registration, please. 
So while he looking for his driver license registration, man, you know what happened? I always smell something, man. Sir, I smell marijuana. You mind stepping out of the vehicle? Stepping out of the vehicle, man. Car found five pounds of weed, man. Five fucking pounds of weed. I don't know what the street value was on that. I know it wasn't no fucking three million dollar, seven thousand pound, hundred and sixty bell Afghan sour diesel hybrid sativa blend cushy goodness smoke that was lost out in the oceans off the coast of this beach in Southern California. I got a message to all you would-be traffickers. Those of you who are the mule. Don't smoke before you go do your fucking job, man. What you transport needs to be out to the people, man. Jackasses. I'm finna go blaze right now, man. Boost myself up. You fuckers done made me so sad. But you know when I feel sad? I stop feeling sad. And be awesome instead. As always, man. I want to thank you. You fantastic, wonderful, amazing people out there in the YouTube nation. As always, rate, comment. I love the feedback, man. If I get a thumbs down, man, before you click off to the next site or, or the next channel, next video, whatever, tell me why I got a thumbs down. I'd appreciate it. Laters.